When an emergency happens, the Emergency Operations Center is ready to respond. Whether it's a major emergency or a big special event, the Emergency Operations Center, or EOC, activates to monitor the situation and keep our citizens safe. EOC is a very important part of the city, especially during times of an emergency such as Harvey. Uh, we were able to bring all different agencies under one roof and we were able to discuss the plans and work out situations and give resources where resources were needed. Well, in the last two or three years, we've had flooding events, obviously Hurricane Harvey, but we also opened up for uh, special events. We opened up for the Buck Day Parade and uh, so any other special events that we might need, a large crowd, we would open up. In the event of an emergency, the EOC will activate and will reach out to the public as quickly as possible to get information out. Here are some ways you can help the EOC keep you informed. Sign up for the reverse alert system. To sign up for the State Emergency Assistance Registry, dial 211 and follow the EOC on their social media accounts for notifications. City prepares year-round actually because it's not only a hurricane or a major event but it's any type of we prepare for all hazard events. So we meet and we plan with different departments on uh, how we're going to take on the event. Uh, we want to make sure that we have a database to, to have the public notified whenever situations occur. Uh, we do tabletop exercises. We meet regularly with different outside agencies so that we're all on the same page and when time comes that we need to uh, activate. So the city, we like to take a proactive instead of reactive approach. Uh, we plan for a worst case scenario, but hope for the best case scenario. For more information and to learn how to prepare your family for an emergency, visit our website, www.cctexas.com. Reporting for the city of Corpus Christi, I'm Yvette Garcia-Jones.